I completely forgot if we're gonna be using this, we can't use that. There we go. Yeah, save me. Oh, okay, now I'm a bit off point. There you go. Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we are gonna to be using a completely different avatar. Normally we use like um, American law enforcement officers or like SWAT team or anything like that. But today we're gonna to be using a British police. You can't really see but it is British police because of that. But normally they would wear a vest. Like this sort of police would wear a vest. If it's like traffic police, they wouldn't wear this vest. But of course we would be a constable, so we would be wearing a vest like this. Due to the uniform choice, normally they are equipped with a vest, pepper spray, taser, handcuffs, baton. Um, normally this sort of stuff that I have here. However, very, very rarely if they're armed to police, they'd have like a little orange dot which would show they're armed to police and they'd have a gun with them as well. But of course I'm not going to be doing an armed to police one, so we are going to be sticking with our main choice of weapon is a taser. This is our main choice, we can't really use anything other than that. Um, so yeah, if it does come to someone taking off, we won't really be able to pop their tyres, we'll just have to pursue them. Um, normally they don't pit people. Yeah, normally they don't pit due to vehicle being... Okay, hold on. <laughs> I just realised normally they don't have a round bar on it. Normally it's a without a ram bar completely. Well, most vehicles don't have a ram bar. That's the spotlight, they always have that, there we go. Yeah, occasionally they don't have a ram bar, so. And this is one of the very few vehicles you don't want around. So if you have a vehicle like this around your sort of neighborhood or anything, just be prepared that it might either be for you or someone near you. Normally these wouldn't really be sent out anywhere. You might see them driving around occasionally, if you're in the UK, but Normally they're not just sent out anywhere. Only for just like very specific reasons. And of course if it's got the orange dot there it means something bad has seriously happened. Like an instant uh, college down the road from my college. Anyways we will be doing basic patrol with the BMW. Well BKM in this game but BMW is based off the BMW. Same design and everything. Um, we won't really be responding to active bank robberies and stuff like that, but we'll only be able to do um, perimeter checks and stuff like that. We won't be able to really engage, because they wouldn't engage unless they were armed. Like, unless the officers are armed, they wouldn't engage. No. Anyway, let's just get straight into the patrol, see what happens. If you think that it's stupid, me constantly using different avatars, and this time using a British police one in an American game, so be it, that is your choice, but I feel like changing avatars once in a while um, is better than sticking with like the same one and using just different vehicles and stuff like that, because, you know, sometimes we'll get bored just seeing the same vehicle. The only thing I can't really change about this is what side of the road we drive on. You can't really change that in any game unless it's in a um, private server, then you could change it, but it just wouldn't make sense at all. So yeah, we're just going to get in to see what happens. Their vehicle is smoking. Well, we've already got the vehicle pinned. Let's see why his car is smoking. I don't think he says much, but. I don't like this here. I don't trust that at all.
Well, I just had to engage and now because he pulled a gun on me. Normally, I would not engage. So, yes, you may say in the comments, um, that's not realistic. They wouldn't engage in that and they'd press the panic button. However, he pulled a gun on me and I originally thought because he put his hands up he was going to surrender. But he didn't. That's the only reason I engaged is because he was looking like he was going to surrender but then he didn't. So that's the only reason I engaged. If he had actually surrendered I wouldn't have engaged in that. I would have just arrested him. But considering he shot after acting like he was going to surrender I then had to engage. You can't drive for shit can you? I do have to repair my car though. really armed police. I don't know if this officer would be armed. I see him unarmed most of the time, but occasionally you can't really tell. Due to the uniforms looking pretty much the same. The only reason you can tell a difference between them is because the armed police shout in your face. They sprint up to you, guns drawn. There's about maybe 10 or 12 of them running at you at a time. And you never see them walking alone or driving alone. There's always at least two, maybe three in a vehicle. And we don't have anything really similar to a bear cat, to be honest, I don't think. I've never seen it, never heard of one, so I don't know if we do. I'm supposing we wouldn't. Vehicle's smoking. Wanted, but he's gonna go fix it. A house robbery. I didn't even notice that we can head down to that. I mean, if they're armed, they're armed. Gonna check what this is about. Can't go in, so they've gone. Active robbery at bank. We can go do like perimeter stuff there. We can't fully engage though. I had engaged before he had pulled that out. Plus he never fired. Oh whoa, that echoed. What? An I heard that, that echoed. Yeah, he. Had plus he hadn't fired, so. Okay, a light tap destroys that, but when I hit a tree or a pole doing 100, it does nothing. Okay. There you go, just throw my vehicle in here. Second time repairing it.
just watched them take down a pole. Destruction of property. Watch them take down two now. I'm not going to get involved in that. There is a pursuit over this way. Cutting through the alleyways. Just because there's an officer in his vehicle, I'm not going to stop chasing him. Yeah, we can't really pit him. And we're not allowed to hit their vehicle either. Well, occasionally we can, but normally we don't. wanted. Go search him here, see if there's anything on him. See, we've only been able to use Taser this whole time. He had an AK on him. He's not allowed to team, so... Okay, fine. Get auto-jailed then. Doesn't bother me, does it? GWP. Can't search his vehicle because he wasn't detained. Got a nice little successful arrest there. really expect me to chase him. Oh, did that also get his car stuck? You see what's going on here, I guess, you know. Why do I always sound echoey in my room? No clue what that's about. around the corner quick. I'm gonna attach myself to this. Shit. Oh, bro's laggier than I am. I mean, his friend just got shot dead. Why am I spinning? <laughs> you spin my head right around. Right, okay. I don't know why I was spinning. Whoa, shots fired at an officer. Oh, what a taser. Lovely little taser. See, I can only use taser. He can use a gun if he needs to. Which is why he shot the other guy dead. But I'm not arms police, so I can't use a gun. I can use a taser, but not a gun. And you would never see that vehicle driving around in the UK. But of course, this isn't a UK one, so. Isn't that the car that was running?
Well, we're in a pursuit now of a red Avantismo, which is an Audi. Loss of texture right there. Took a drift, but failed. Go, we're in pursuit of him again. This texture loss is mad. I don't have a ram bar, so I can't pit him because I'm trying to make this as realistic to the UK as possible. I need another unit to join in. Keep a distance, we don't want him to like juke us out or anything. Heading down towards gas station now, well, farms gas station anyway. I think that other unit has seen me. Yeah, he's trying to join him. He should have a Rambo, I believe. He just leaves like that. It's a real piss take that is. Like, even if you lost a police, it doesn't bother me. Just accept a citation. Stop being a wimp about a citation. Like, it's not going to kill you, is it? That's of course to make sure you're bankrupt, but in this game, you shouldn't really be going bankrupt. It's easy to rob a store and get away with it. Just rob a gas station. Have like a thousand pound there, right? Someone cites you for 200, you're still good, you're all set. I don't know how people can go bankrupt. I just watched him stab an officer. He's wanted for knife crime now. We wouldn't really go in oncoming lanes to be fair. But I mean it's a clear highway, there's no one on it. I say that and then there's a car coming down the watch. No, there isn't, but still. There was a car there.
Where did he go? Oh, there he is. That's probably him. He's got assault on a police officer, felony evasion, murder of a police officer. I could think of many other things, speeding, running red lights, reckless driving, public endangerment, carrying illegal weapons, all sorts of things. And yet I decided to only charge him with those three. That's what he would have been charged for anyway. Gas station explosion near downtown Springfield. I mean, we probably would do traffic control there to be fair. Let's just send our vehicle through here and we'll head over to that. So we don't do traffic control there. Just head down to the Sioux Traffic Control, that's all we're really going to do. Tape, we can use that. Yeah, the tape's too long. Could use a crowd fence actually, or a police barricade. Okay. Well, no one else is coming through then. That's all that we're allowing through. While they deal with this. I'm guessing it's all out to be fair. 
guessing they've just put it all out. Yeah. Well, an officer's mentioned gun store, so I'm guessing. Oh, it's shots fired at gun store. We wouldn't head down to that normally, but we will now. Due to there not being many officers, we're going to head down to that. We'll probably just do traffic control. Or we might switch to armed police. Yeah, you know what? I'll switch to armed police for this. Fuck off. That looks wrong. That looks wrong. That does not look any better. <laughs> that does not look any better. <laughs> oh my. That's bad. That looks so bad. Oh my days. Oh, that looks awful. Oh wait, FD healed me. Thanks. FD. Oh wait, he's over there. Should I thank him for helping me? There you go. And all I need to do... Drive to mod shop. Now I'm pretty sure I can end this video if I wanted to, to be fair. Hmm. Undercover getting pulled over. British police uniform is quite nice to be fair. You know, what, let's head down to jewellery store for one last call. Throws <laughs> like 3 XP. Fair enough. 
Well, we helped an officer get back on his feet again. Um, we did try and arrest that suspect, but he had taken off. There's an air support suspect. If they're not in handcuffs by the time I get there, then we'll head over and deal with it. If they are in handcuffs by the time I get there, I'll just head back and end the video at the station. Why he's running with a gun out when he shouldn't be. Yeah, both those tires are popped. Can't really do much about that, can we? We turned into armed police like right at the last second. Strange, but it works, I guess. We did have to deal with that little call, but we didn't really do anything. I didn't even know the other guy wasn't wanted. He was just running around with a gun. And then the guy that got tased was the suspect, apparently. They could have notified, but yeah. Anyways, unfortunately, guys, that does have to end the video there. Thank you all so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy this one, please do leave a like and subscribe if you'd like to see more of this. And let me know in the comments down below as well. Anyways, I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.